Right, hello YouTube, M6 IQJ back again. I've got a new package in the mail, but before we uh, open it up, I um, just want to say a big thank you to all my new sub subscribers on YouTube. It really helps me out a lot. Thank you very much for subscribing. It seems to me that people are liking what I'm doing on the bicycle. So uh, I'll do some more videos on the bike. Maybe go to different locations and try and kind of get a few different people. Um, who even knows, I might even get a porter pack on the bike. That's what uh, Johnny Jaffa Cake said that they put the port pack on the bike and see how far I get on it. It'd be quite interesting. Anyway, um, let's open up the package. And as the EEV blog guy says, welcome to everyone's favourite segment, mailbag. Where I open up my mail. What? Right, what we got in the mail here? This is, here we go, an MFJ 557 Morse code. Oscillator. Now, built in straight key, heavy non skid metal base, and it's down there it says oscillator. So let's open it up and take a closer look. So we've got the destructions. So we need that to put the battery in the way we go. Let's take a closer look at the unit itself. Ooh, quite a bit of weight to this. So you got your volume, you've got your tone, you've got your key, and that's about it. You've got your built in speaker there. Also got a DC input, 12 volts. Tip's got to be positive, I believe. And you've got your earphone for private listening. Now, I thought that might have clicked on or off, but it's not clicking on or off. So I presume when it's not being pressed down, it's not in use. So what I'll go and do now is I'll stick a battery in it and then uh, have a little test, see if it all works. So you need to undo the screw there and the screw there. So I'll go and test whether it works. Catch you in a sec. Right, a battery has gone in, but all we're getting is just a tone, constant tone. We can make the tone high pitched or lower pitched and the reason we're getting the tone is because the key is constantly pressed down we need to do a little adjustment on the top screw there we can adjust it so we get a lock play like that but I don't want it like that I want it so we've got a, a little play on the key so, like that there we go, so now we can start practicing Morse code. So we should all be familiar with which is the SOS, just the tone there. Now in the comments below, I'm going to type something out of Morse, in the comments below, tell me what it is I'm typing and tell me where you've heard it. So. So where was that from? What letters was I typing? And where's it from? You all know that one. Come on, easy one on. But we're going to do some CQDX. So again, I've got to make a different tone on it. And there we go. It should be CQDX. And if it was a CQDE, it'd be at the end just a dot. I've also found. I can disconnect these terminals, disconnect this, these two here, the key will come out. I can put a suitable audio cable in there, I'll strip one down, put the, connect to the terminals and put the other end in the radio and I can use it, this key, on a real radio but I'm not going to do that, that's what my other key is coming for. I'm just going to use this one to practice. So I will say best 7.3s and thanks for watching, this is M6 IQJ. Cheers and beers.